Reactions continue to trail the abandoned Federation Cup semi-final clash between Crown FC and FC Ifayuba at the Amadou Bello Stadium in Kaduna. The game was inconclusive owing to a pitch invasion by angry fans who attacked the centre referee over alleged bias officiating. Same manager of FC Ifayuba, Chidi Samuel, denied the club had influenced the referee in a semi-final clash. What our duty to say whether he did or that, okay? Everybody is entitled to his own opinion. I cannot say their minds. We all have a good game. It's, a, it's not an easy game. Knowing, knowing what is on ground. They are packing in the final and they want to go there. So I cannot say what's the first reasons of coming inside the field. Like I told you, it is left for the referees to interpret the rules of the game. It's not our duty. From my own view, for I lay my view, it's a clear offside. There are two people there. Meanwhile, the Commissioner of Sports in Oyo State, Abaya Miyoki, has described the centre referee in the tie as the 12th man on the pitch. He told Channels Television in Kaduna that the referee ruined what was supposed to be a good game between his team, Crown FC of Ibado and FC Ifanyoba. To be a, a promotion for Nigerian football, the entertainment in the first half was phenomenal. And in the second half, I think... Um, we can see the desperation of the 12th man on the field, FIFA Nigeria, and they proved it. The second goal, the last man has already taken it as a goal. Even the Ifa and Bay players had already felt dejected that it was a goal. I don't see why the referee disallowed it. So obviously he was playing to a script. I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to say that because as a lawyer I don't have the facts. But from the officiating, it was, it was obvious as it wasn't a good officiating, unless you think this was good officiating after following football for some time.